The championship could be claimed right here. Folks, it is electric in the arena for this Game 6 of the NBA Finals. So glad you could join us for it. In this game, we'll see the Portland Trail Blazers going up against the Boston Celtics here in Boston. This is Kevin Harlan alongside Clark Kellogg and Mike Fratello. And we've got David Aldridge joining us from the sideline.
looking to bounce back after the bitter loss on Saturday. It's an absolute must that you bring energy on the road, and they did not have it in that loss in the last meeting. And that shows up in the opposing offensive number. Again, the miss by the Celtics. Portland's gone one or two from long range in the first quarter. Pass to Red. And we're approaching about three and a half minutes played in the first quarter. Down to five on the shot clock. Doesn't get a good drop for him. Celtics have gone three or five in the ball so far. Holton with the ball. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring yet from him. Here's Cassell. It's blocked. Here's Mashburn. He has five. That's it. And he's now three for three and looking sharp. It's so difficult to slow down when he gets that fire in his eyes. Offensively, Clark, things have sort of fallen apart for him. And they need to recover as soon as possible. Cassell with the screen on red to stop the drought. And it's Ford with the rebound. I love how he challenged the shot. That takes some guts near the hoop. Pass to red. Feed to four. Here's both. Here's Walton. A good finish at the rack off the slick feet. Attacking the paint that time. Unfazed by the bigger defender. Touch, angles, whatever it takes to elude the shot blocker. That was the 2K drive. Does that move deserved another look? He made that drive look easy, but that had a high degree of difficulty. Walton with the ball after the basket by Boston. The pass to four. No good that time. And the Celtics going the other way now. Here's Cassell. Banked in off the glass. Attacking in the painted area. Clearly, that was their game plan coming in. Over to the wing. Here's Mashburn. He's guarded by Knight. And that one is stuck right through. Using his handles to get to the rim. Incredible sequence we just saw. Yes, indeed. Great overall play. Now, here's Walton. Passes it to Bowen. Back to Walton. Pass to Bowen. Celtics passing it around. Here's Ford. Oh, and that one had the right spit on it, and it is good. Ford's got his second basket of the night. This is why coaches preach ball movement. Keeps everyone engaged. Walton, the pass to Westerman. Over red. Tipped away. They shoot again. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. First personal foul, first team foul. The Celtics shooting their first free throws tonight. The first trip to the stripe in this one. At the line for two. Checked in for Cassell. Dawkins checked in for Port.
and he sinks the second. The Trailblazers have gone six of nine, shooting well. The dish to four. The shot, no good. And it's Boston the other way. To the middle. Here's Johnson. Plays it up and banks it in. Johnson's got it all tied up now for the Celtics. Teams love hammering the ball inside and getting easy looks. Head passes to four. Here's Dawkins. It's right outside. Drills the three-pointer. Three. And the Trailblazers lead by three. The defense was wanting, and he gave it to him. And Walton to Westerman. To the inside. It's tipped. And now here comes Red leading the break. Here's Dawkins. And he gets that one to go off the front iron. Now it's a five-point Trailblazer lead. And look at how the hustle game has been going for the Trailblazers. Walton the pass to Westerman. Outside Knight. They set the pick. Shot clock at six. No good on the three. Portland leading by five. Ford passes to Dawkins. To the right side. Pass to Gaines. To the left side wing. Boston with the rebound. Outside Knight. And there's the pass to Walton. And Westerman kicks to Walton. Passes it to Johnson. Over Gaines. That's tipped. And so it looks like the Celtics will retain possession here. Time called here. The Celtics decide to talk it over. And Boston has possession. Trailing by five. And finished off by Conley. Leaving no margin for error. That was a terrific finish. Clark, this is what happens when you refuse to box them out. Yep. You have great positioning and even better timing. Superb work on the offensive glass. Here's Dawkins. After the basket by Boston. 
back to Griffin. Five to shoot. The Trailblazers need to get off the shot. From outside, off the mark. And so it's Johnson who brings the ball up for the Boston Celtics. Ryan laid the pass to Waters. Knocked away. And out of bounds as the Trailblazers gain possession. A sensational block that definitely deserves another look. Hey, bringing that postseason intensity, so critical. You know, these plays can change the trajectory and outcome of a game. Portland leading by three. Now Gaines. He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. Laid outside. There's the pick. Over Conley. Here's Erhard. And he takes the fantastic lead pass up strong for the slam. And hopefully that one-handed dunk gets him going. I think that's why he went for it. These guys need a boost, don't they? Yep. Especially a game this close. No question. There's Tinsley. It's stolen. And Duncan slams it in. A devastating punch. They can't afford to give up a dunk like this when they're trying to come back. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, there was a statement behind that dunk. One that says, you aren't going to come back in this one, buddy. Yeah, that has to shake their confidence in their defense. Tough blow. Austin with the ball. The Blazers getting the bucket. Goes up on the wing. It's Tinsy. That time on the assist from Conley. And when you're guarding him, you've got to fight over the top. Lock and trail around the screen and deny the perimeter shot. Griffin. The rebound by the Celtics. Even though they came up empty, that's exactly the shot they want. They'll take that kind of look every time down the floor. Hopefully with a different result next time. Count it good. Now just a three-point trailblazer lead. That's a textbook example of how to move the ball. Boy, you got to love that action. Tinsley covering. A fader. Wade misses. They can't expect him to miss that shot consistently. Coach Rogelio, they've been effective on the offensive end in this one. Yeah, they've created good looks and made the most of that. Now, here's Wade. Nothing yet on the scoreboard for him. Gains the pass to Dawkins. 43 seconds left here in the first quarter. Just five to shoot. Wade for three. Rebound by Johnson. Well, that's a quality look for him. Probably surprised himself with that miss. Yeah, the defense can't continue to give him that shot and expect the same results. Here's Gaines. And they call the foul. So a chance at the line for one more coming up. Tremendous individual play challenging the heart of that defense. And he's got his first chance at the line here. At the line four. What's up? Celtics trail by four. Here's one. Pass to Johnson. And block. That one goes careening off the glass. And that's out of bounds. Boston will retain possession. Just four seconds left in the first. Fades back. And he got that one up in time, but doesn't go in. And that concludes the first quarter of play. It's the Trailblazers leading by four. And we'll get the second quarter underway on the other side of the sprint.
and good to have you with us for 2K Sports coverage of Game 6. And for Portland guys, what jumps out to you, Stan White? Well, they've been the more composed team. They've gotten quality looks, and they're playing under control. And on the other end, applying pressure and forcing mistakes. So the turnover differentials in their favor. Portland leading by four. Here's Dawkins. Here's Mashburn. And the layup's good off the glass. Mashburn's got the opening field goal of the second quarter for the Trailblazers. The Celtics shooting well, 50% for the four. And Westerman kicks to Johnson. Nice ball movement by Boston. Waters passes to Westerman. Johnson surveying the floor. Off the mark there with the three-point shot. Trailblazer shooting has been beyond great up until now. How about 57% from the field overall? Things are coming together nicely for him offensively. Gelling well, starting to build the lead. Yeah, it's all coming together on that end. Just need to maintain this forward momentum. Here's one. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. And oh boy, a lot of contact there, but he gets the call and will shoot two. Austin shooting their third and fourth free throw shots of the night. Taking two shots. Makes the first. And Johnson drops them both. And we're about a minute into the second quarter of play. Out to the right wing. Ashburn, the pass to Gaines. Now Ford, he's covered by Cassell. And he goes in for the dunk. Offensively, they've clearly and far and away been the more efficient team. Yeah, the offense is running smoothly. And it's only the first half, but they've looked more prepared for this matchup. Now, here's Johnson. Pass to Cassell. Back to Johnson. Pocket six. Pass to Cassell. That's in there. Johnson with the assist. Trailblazers leading by six. Passes to four. And taken away by Johnson. Outside Conley. And the dunk by Conley. Showing off some big time athleticism and adding a little extra flair. Just like you, Clark, you used to say, hey, if you've got it, flaunt it. And you Let did. Let it flow. <laughs> Let it flow. Well, thankfully, he made it. But I'm sure his coach would like a more cautious approach in that situation. You know, I think that was a message-sending foul there. I'm not going to allow any easy buckets at the rim. Yeah, as a coach, I like that one. Make them earn it at the line. The Trailblazers have made three free throws so far. Haven't missed any. Super two. And he can't get the first one. Both teams deciding to change it up. He hits the second from the line. Celtics trail by five. Quarter two and just under two and a half minutes gone by. A nice shot by Knight. Really nice job moving the ball around that time. Picking apart that defense. Over to the left wing. Goes up with the strike. Nice jump shot. Good. 
Fishburne's got 16. No idea what they were thinking there defensively. I mean, that's a shot he makes off of. So the Celtics call timeout. They're first. Not a bad time to pump the brakes right here, check in with everybody, and make sure you're speaking in stereo. Could be a chance to adjust the lineup as well. Well, Celtics making the switch here. Owens checked in. Walton, the pass to Westerman. Over four. Put on that shot, and with that, the Trailblazer lead is cut down now to just two points with that basket from both. You know, it wouldn't be a bad idea to put an extra body on him, get some help. Girls is way in close. Such a good finisher, he needs more than one guy to defend him. Now, here is Red. Here's Mashburn, and it's Jenna. And a little under three and a half minutes elapsed in the second quarter of play. Here's Westerman. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Down low. Down to five on the shot clock. In that one, good. Seems to have a knack for hitting guys in their spots. His vision, excellent. For Portland, they've gone four of six in the field here in the second. Pass to Mashburn. Overnight. Found that one for Mashburn. Mashburn's got nine points in the quarter. He's been a reliable offensive option, currently maintaining an impressive field goal percentage in this game. Pass to Bowen. Outside night for the three. Rebound by the Trailblazers. Ford's got four rebounds in this game. Right up top. A turnaround J. That's it. He's got two made now, and he's shooting two for three. And so Knight will bring it up for Boston. Four-point game. Now the pass to Westerman. from him in their last game. Lots of confidence. Here's Meshmer. 18 points for him. Second shot opportunity, and that one is good. Ford's got eight points. It's simple. you got to get a body into your man. Box out if you want to rebound the ball. Defensive rebounding is about effort. Try being willing to put a body on someone. Here's Westerman. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring yet from him. And the basket is good. Yes, Portland leading. Pass to Gaines. Now, here is four. Defense is right there. Here's Red. And he goes up strong with one hand and flushes it down. In a tight game, plays like this make the difference. Firing up his team and giving them part some much-needed momentum. Yeah, when it's close, you have to fight for every play. We love the intensity he's bringing.
pass to Westerman. Over red. And it'll go. And the Blazer lead is cut down to one in the bucket for Westerman. A nice sense of when to move the ball and get the assist. To the wing on the left. Here's Mashburn. He's guarded by Knight. And it's good. Two points. Mashburn's got 11 points in the quarter. The defense getting hung up on the pick there. They've got to get over it. And every time they don't, they're just allowing the shooter to find the jumper. To the left side wing. Here's Westerman. Pass to Cassell. And he gets the basket. Officials pouring the whistle, so a chance at the line for one more. When he gets room like that, look out, because he will score. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. Griffin's check in for the Trailblazers. One shot. One shot. Drops. He ties it up. The Trailblazers shooting 61%, showing all the indications of an offense that is locked in. Now, here is four. Tight defense on him. Yep, it counts. And the Trailblazers lead by two. Excellent vision on display, dropping a dime to set up his teammates. Cassell with the screen on red. Westerman passes to Cassell. And it's thrown down hard with both hands. No room for error there because he's threw it down with both hands. Pretty smart. Yeah, with the score this close, you can't afford any mistakes. Boy, a miss slam would have been deflated. Nice to see him finish it off. The shot's good. They're punishing those late defensive rotations, getting good looks inside throughout the half. Here's Westerman. This is it to Cassell. And that basket is going to count. Goaltending the official call. Kudos for the effort, but he got there a little too late. And the Trailblazers making a change here. Wade's checked in. Cassell's gone a terrific six of eight shooting from the floor. Pass to four. To the wing right side. And here is Red. He has five. And that one drops. So it's the Celtics now. Trailing by two. Here's the pass to Cassell. To the inside. Nice pass. Nice catch and a resounding dunk. Amazing one-handed punch right there. Oh, man, on a mission, Clark. You're right. In a close game, showing some ferocity. These are the dunks you better finish if you're going up with just one hand. And that one, good. Ford's got 12 points in the game. Boston's gone two of four from three-point range so far in the second quarter. Westerman has it to Sullivan. Here's Bowen, guarded by four. With the shot, Cassell. And foul on the shot, so he'll get a chance at the line. You know, there are occasions when contact doesn't affect the shot. That sure did. Easy call for the refs. The Celtics shooting their sixth and seventh free throw attempts tonight. from Cassell. Hawkins check in for the Trailblazers. So he makes one of two as the second one misses. To the left wing. Back to Ren. He's getting his first free throw attempt of the night right now. Shooting for Two shots. Take a break. 
Tucson. First free throw is good. Celtics making a switch here. Conley's checked in. Both free throws good from Red. Celtics trail by three. Passes it to Sullivan. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. Hits the target from 18 feet. Here's Red. He feeds it to Griffin. Passed to Dawkins. Tries it from 19, and there it is for him. Dawkins has got his third bucket of the night. You can tell he scanned the whole floor and found the exact right guy to feed. to Tinsley. Three-pointer. And it's Portland with the rebound. Outside Griffin. And the pass to Dawkins. Back to Griffin. Out to the wing. They set the pick. Here's Erhan. Got a piece of it. And he gets it back. 129 left in the first half of the game. Griffin passes it away. Out to the right wing. Here's Water. Over Dawkins. It'll go. The Portland lead is cut down to just one on the basket from Waters. Slick crossover move. The defense had no way of keeping up. Now left of the wing. Here's Dawkins. He's got six. It's red outside. Carries it from three-point range. Red's got nine points in the quarter. With the shooter of his talent, you have to do more defensively. Really chase him off his spot. Griffin with the steal. Passes it to Dawkins. Back to Griffin. Kicks it to Wade. To the middle. Pick off in midair. There's a four-second difference from the shot clock to the game clock. Here's Waters. Again, the Celtics good for two. And here's Griffin. He'll bring it up for the Portland Trailblazers. Fires for three. And that'll do it for the first half of competitive game so far. Trailblazers lead by two. And don't go away. After the break, we'll see you right back here for the start of the third quarter. And it's time for more of the NBA Finals on 2K Sports. What a time of year. Portland's gone three to seven tonight from three-point territory. Head kicks to four. Over Bowen. Four. That's good. Ford's got it going here in the start of the second half. The first points in the third quarter for the Trailblazers. Now here's Knight. Jacks up a three. Connects from three-point range. Striking it from distance. No hesitation at all. He's had it going. Good aggressive from that side. Red pushes to four. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. The Trailblazers have put up good numbers in the charity stream, converting six of seven.
first one falls for. Always a plus to have a big guy stroke it from the line like that. The soft touch on full display. Walton the pass to Cassell. Shoots over Gaines, and it'll go. And the Blazer lead is cut down to just one on the bucket from Cassell. Nice hooks out there. That's a coaching move for him. And about a minute of action so far in the third quarter. Gaines the pass to four. Six to shoot. And it's blocked. Here's Westerman, guarded by Red. For the lead. And the layup is good. Yes. Westerman's got eight points. The defense couldn't collapse quickly enough. Westerman's gone four for five from the floor tonight. Just one miss. Feeds it to Gaines. Over a minute and a half into the third quarter of that red shot is right there here in the second half mike these teams are still right next to each other neck and neck i like that each side is matching the other's intensity so enjoyable here's bowen he has five it's deflected here's cassell gets it to go for bucket number eight he's taken just 10 shots Ray of Blazers have gone two of three from the field to shoot the second half. Red passes to four. Back to Red. Let's it go with a three. The best be good off the assist from four. Ford's got his third assist on the night. Not quite two and a half minutes played here in the second half. Cassell with the screen on Red. Westerman has it to Bowen. Here's Westerman, guarded by Red, 16 feet away, and another basket for Boston. You know, I think they've got to show a little more anticipation dealing with these screens because right now they're just laying on them and getting stuck. Yeah, you have to go over the top or duck under. Right now they're seemingly trying to go through the screen. Pass to Westerman. Keeps going. Three minutes into the second half now. Outside Knight. And there's the pass to Westerman. And the three off target. Portland's gone four of eight tonight from three point land, shooting 50% on the three ball here. The rebound by Walton. For Boston, they've gone five of seven from the field in the third quarter. Let's see if they can keep it up. They set the screen. Pass to Bowen. This is it to Westerman. Fires the three. And it's Ford with the rebound. Ford's got seven rebounds in the game. Red passes to Mashburn. The feed to four. Overnight. Nails the baby hook. Ford's got six in the quarter. The ball distribution was there. I mean, outstanding work all the way around. Pass to Bowen. He locks up the alley pass. And there's the second time to finish it off. He's having a really good night from the field. I know the defense is keying in on him. He's the marquee on the scouting report, but they need him involved if they're going to pull this out. Here's Meshburn. He's got 20. Gaines, no luck. Cassell against four. And he pings it home with one hand. Going for the one hand to slam right there. Old school classic move. And he had the room, Clark, so why not go for it? Make it happen. Maybe he can do it a few more times and help open this game for them a little. Now a timeout called by Portman.
Portland trailing here. Here's Meshburn. Dishes it to Red. Here's Mashburn. The basket is good. The assist from Gaines. Mashburn's got the game tied up here for Portland. Interesting use of the fadeaway, but hey, it worked. Here's Westerman. He's got eight. And it's Ford with the rebound. Ford's got rebound number eight now on the night. Here's Gaines, up and in on the way. Gaines has got five now. Yeah, against a much taller player, you've got to be slick and wily. Figure out a way to get your shot off against a bigger guy. I think it helps if you have a quick release, change of direction, just don't be deliberate. Here's Westerman. Cassell with the screen on red. Here's Westerman. Here's Cassell. Score the basket for his 10th mate. 10 for 12. 83% accuracy. Well, that rebound and score right there shows me he's locked in. Maybe going back to the last game. He was attacking like this last game as well. Ferocious effort. Back to back outings. Gains the pass to four. Inside. Trailblazers moving the ball around. Took the opportunity when he saw it. Seven points in the game. Great awareness to recognize the double and get the pass away. Celtics trail by three. Walton with the ball. Bowen the pass to Cassell. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. Personal foul, first team foul. And a chance for just a second now to check out the scoring breakdown for the Trailblazers. Taking two shots. Shooting two. So both teams making some changes here. And so Kassan nails both of them. Trailblazers have gone 7 of 11, a lucky field goal percentage here in the third. Here's Dawkins. He's got six. Count that bucket. Dawkins has got eight points. Rather than wearing down, both teams picking up steam in the second half. Like a sprint to the finish. Something's gotten into them at halftime. Sullivan. He's off on that one. And it's Portland the other way. Ashburn, the pass to Dawkins. Over to the wing. Fires from 18. Ashburn, no good. Celtics trail by three. 18 feet out. Offensive rebound. Cassell gets the bucket. Cassell's got 12 now in this quarter. Effort is a skill. And one he possesses in abundance. The pass to Griffin. Here's Ashburn. Back to Griffin. Oh, he blocked it and deflects off the backboard. Ashburn, no good. Got the look he wanted. Sometimes it just doesn't go down. Kicks tonight. For the lead. That one a tad off line to the right, but drops in for him. He's got 17. And now we'll get a perspective here on the hustle game how it's been going for the Celtics. So timeout called here. The first for Portland. <laughs> and the Celtics making a change here. Conley's checked in. And the Trailblazers making a change here as well. Wade's checked in.
Portland's gone two of two from long range in the third quarter so far. Feeds it to Griffin. Stolen by Conley. Jumps up. Fouled on the shot and picks up two points. So one free throw coming up. Impressive how he endured that contact and still got the shot to go down. That took a lot of focus and just the right amount of power. And he's got his first chance at the line here. That's good from Conley. Here's Griffin. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. Pass to Mashburn. There's the pick. Will it go? Here's Erhan. And it's blocked by Conley. Johnson outside. He dishes it to Conley. is the storyline of this game. Oh, it does. Playing with confidence and swagger. You guys, I remember when I could get up like that. Here's Dawkins after the basket by Boston. Here's Mashburn. He's got 22. His shooting has just dropped off from this court. He needs to rediscover his rhythm. Conley is surveying the D. Here's Waters. Good on the three-point shot. Waters got the lead up to nine now for the Celtics. Building their lead here in the third quarter. They're continuing to work. Yeah, they seem to have some renewed energy here in the second half. Now a timeout called by Portland. Blazers trail by nine. Here's Dawkins. Eight points for him. Looking to end the run. And they call the foul. So he's got the and one chance here to make it a three-point play. Absolutely fearless with that mid-range shot. Surprised he got it up and over. That looked like he just knew where he was on the court. Great job to finish the play. Celtics leading by six. Waters passes to Johnson. Here's Waters. He's got seven. A high post shot, and it's Boston with another. Hard to defend against that. Give him credit for staying in control on the difficult turnaround, Jay. Passes it to Griffin. Here's Mashburn. Shot's good. Griffin making the play. Ashburn's got seven points for the quarter. That's serving it up on the platter there. What a nice pass. A high percentage look was the result. Sullivan. Wade is covering. And the basket by one. I love the efficiency he's playing with tonight. Not scoring as much as you do, but he's been effective. And they're winning. Now here's Wade. No points in the game yet for him. 49 left in the third quarter of the game. Draws the whistle and nearly gets the ball. That would have been an impressive and one. But instead, he'll shoot two at the line. The Trailblazers have gone 9 of 10 from the line, so making the most of their chances. And the 
Selvich making a change here. Tinsley's checked in. And both free throws good for Dawkins. Austin leading by seven. Pass to Sullivan. Let's the free fly. And the Celtics hit again from deep. Hey, it's as plain as pound cake. Keep it simple. They want to see how big this lead can get. No such thing as running up the score at this level. Now here's Wade. He's still scoreless so far in this one. We've got 123 left in the third quarter. And Dawkins slams it in. Took his frustration out on the rim right there. Yep, and perhaps that can give him a little shot of adrenaline. Sometimes it counts more than just two points. Here's one. He's got ten. The pass to Tinsley. That three off the mark. That was absolutely his shot to miss. Plenty of room at the arc. All set up. Just couldn't get it to fall. Portland moving the ball. Stolen away. Here's Waters. And there are the Celtics with another basket. Trailblazers trail by 10. Pass to Griffin. 34 seconds left in the third quarter. Here's Mashburn. Good on the 13-footer. Mashburn's got 29 in the game. I think he's got to show more fight than that. Can't give up on the play once you get screened. you got to continue to fight through. And Coach is definitely going to be frustrated with that effort. Or lack of one, that is. Air hop. Over by Conley. Pass to Dawkins. Pass to Griffin. Takes the three. And again, it's Portland with the three. Three points. Coming out of halftime, both of these teams have raised their intensity up. We have the game's heating up, and the fans are going to circle. Shots continuing to fall as we conclude the third quarter. Both teams putting up points. It's the Celtics leading by five. And we're coming right back. Be sure to stay with us as we get started for the fourth quarter. It's been a very competitive game so far as we get rolling here in quarter number four. Riven against Knight. Let's it fly from 18. That shot misses. And the Trailblazers going the other way. Then passes to Dawkins. Outside Griffin. Covered by Johnson. Outside for Griffin. Five on the clock. Four to screen on Knight. Here's Griffin. And off the left side of the rim. And it swirls in for him. Griffin's got the first points up on the board here in the fourth for Portland. Here's Water. Back to Knight. Three-pointer. Sinks the triple. Knight's got 20 points. It's obvious he's looking to continue to attack on offense so this lead can expand. And if you were hitting like he is in this one, you would be too. His efficiency has done a lot for that. Wow! Oh, my goodness. Big time flush. Oh, that is extra sweet in a close one like this, is it? Yeah. Yeah, that'll really fire up his team. And, yes, it's good. Both offenses, I tell you, are cooking with gas right now. We've got a shootout on our head. Look out. Kicks it to four. About a minute and a half into the fourth quarter now. Head passes to Dawkins. There's the screen. A 19-foot shot. And the Trailblazers getting another bucket right there. In a big moment, you go to your star. And that's what they did. And he delivered. As a team, they have a lot of confidence in him taking those high-pressure shots. He embraces the challenge. Trailblazers trail by four. To the paint. Here's Erhan. Boom! He jams it straight down. Slamming it down with a single forearm. 
arm right there. Woo, and the lift that he was able to get on that. Wow, incredible. That could be a game-changing finish. What a play. Sullivan, guarded by Red. Here's Sullivan, and he wills that one in. Sinking right through off the back iron. Portland's gone 6 of 10 from three-point range, up over 50% for the ball game. Puts it up from 17. That's it, and the Celtic lead is cut back down to just two points. The basket there coming from Red. Boy, oh, gets some space and hits the big-time shot. Exactly what the doctor ordered. He yeah, found room for mid-range. You'd think the defense would be keen on it. to Dawkins. And Portland again with the bucket. With the ball on the string, just getting anywhere he wants to go. Boston's gone one or two from three-point range here in the fourth. Here's the lob to the hoop. And oh, what a play. He just palms the block. Right up top to the left wing. Dawkins. You cannot afford mistakes like that, especially in a tight game. Sacrificing his body, putting it on the line right there. That takes tremendous grit. Taking charges, not for the faint of heart. Glad we got the chance to see that remarkable rejection. It's a different kind of defense teams that play in the postseason. Much more intense, more in your face. High energy plays like that one are winning plays. The Trailblazers making a switch here. Gaines has checked in. The Celtics have gone three of seven from the four in the fourth. That's a 42% mark in the court. Time call here. The Celtics decide to talk it over. Sally's check in for the Celtics. Let's check in with our reporter, David Aldridge. Hey, Kevin. Well, the head coach for Boston had some instruction for the guys during the timeout. This game is obviously close, could go either way, and he wanted to make sure that his guys were all on the same page and were all staying with the game plan in order to close this one out. Kevin? All right, thank you, David. Knight, wide open. Good. And it's Holton who picks up the assist. Knight's got a pair of threes here in the fourth quarter for the Celtics. Here's Gaines. He's covered by Cassell. Ford passes to Gaines. There's the dish to Ford. Field goal number nine. He's nine of 12 with that basket. He knows he can't waste his possession, so he works his way inside for a point blank look. No reason to settle in these situations. If they're going to give that up, he's going to take it. Here's Bowen. The Celtics working the ball around now. Cassell against four. Cassell to Westerman. Here's Bowen. Offensive rebound, Gordon. and he makes it look easy, dunking it hard with one hand. Position for success there, excellent focus, working that backboard. Boy, you said he able to grab it and send it right back in. And not taking any chances, he finishes the play strong. Now, here is four. Goes back up, and he lays it up and in. Ford's got 10 points in just the second half. Clearly a mix-up defensively there. Way too easy inside. And in a close game, those can come back to haunt you. Here's Cassell. Plays it up off the glass. And the Celtics lead by three. That's simply an outstanding play. Working the size mismatch right at the rim. 
Here's Gaines, and a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. Well, there's a reason it was way off. He got fouled. Yeah, easy whistle. At the line for the two bases. Two shots. one falls. Six of 11 since the start of the fourth quarter. Walton, the pass to Westerman. Over Red. And it's Boston with another. Trail Blazers trail by three. Who kicks it to game? Ford. Good that time either. Celtics leading by three. Pass it to Westerman. Here's Bone. Guarded by four. The kick out to walk. That's to Westerman. Pocket six. Over red. And there are the Celtics with another basket. Rather than wearing down, both teams picking up steam in the second half. Like a sprint to the finish. Something's gotten into them at halftime. Boston foul. Walton. Second pressure foul. Second team foul. Checking in for Brooklyn. the first. Both shots good from the strike. Austin leading by three. Outside night. by Boston. Pass to Walton. Shot clock at six. Wide open look. And there's Knight. That's good on the assist by Walton. Walton's got four assists now to You know, if I'm coaching this team, I'm telling everybody to get him the ball the rest of the way. And that is a major reason they're in a position to win this game. He's been a consistent, reliable scoring option all game long. And that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. Second personal foul, fourth team foul. At the line for the two bases. Four. At the line for two.
free throw. No good. And the second free throw. Good. Tough miss at this juncture. They're down two baskets right now. And it's blocked. The pass to Gaines. Here's Mashburn. From 13, the basket is good. The assist from Gaines. Assist goes to Gaines has got four assists in the game. Nothing like setting someone up. Feels better than making a shot. To me, at least. Now, here's Walton. Here's Westerman. Oh, and that one, no question. Powered it down. How about that finish from the point man? <laughs> Taking it straight to the rack. He wasn't leaving any room for interference. And in a close game, this kind of a play is so energizing. Just look at his bench going wild. Cuts it five from 18. He hits the back iron and sinks the shot. And when you're guarding him, you've got to fight over the top. Lock and trail around the screen and deny the perimeter shot. Out to the wing. And foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. First two He's off on the first. Dawkins checked in for Portland. Good on the second free throw. Trailblazers trail by three. Now a timeout called by Portland.
vicious to gain. Over to the left wing. Six on the shot clock. Shoots from the elbow. Connects the jumper toes. Austin's gotten off four three-pointers in the final quarter, and two of them have fallen. This is it to Cassell. Good work there as it goes. Cassell's got four points now in the quarter. Beautiful setup. They found the size mismatch inside, and he delivered when they really needed it. Now a timeout called by Portland. Blazers trail by three. Fades. Gets it to drop, and now he's shooting at a five for eight clip. Boy, the coach must have lit a fire under them at halftime. Oh, yeah. They've upped the intensity. Play with passion. Great to see. Mr. Bowen. Outside night for three. Another shot. He lays it in. Cassell's got 18 points now here in the second half. It's winning time, and that's a winning play. Now a timeout called by Porton.
Trailblazers trail by three. Gains the pass to Dawkins. Here's the screen. The rebound by the Celtics. Bowen's got his seventh rebound here tonight. And here is Knight. Pass to Cassell. Releases. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. Second personal foul. Second team foul. Shooting for Boston. Taking two shots. decide to talk it over.
43 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. Resterman passes to Cassell. Here's Westerman, and he's covered by Dawkins. No good on the shot. Ford. 20 seconds left in the fourth. Ford is screen on night. Mashburn to take the lead. Ooh, off one. Trying to make something happen here. They have to be aggressive at this point, even if it's risking the foul. Yeah, it would have been better to use it on the floor, not on the shot. But the foul had to come one way or another. He sinks the clutch free throw. quarter of this one is what you take. A chance to tie it up right here. They know the touch they can, so does their coach. They need a solid play to knock this one up. We've got 13 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Here's Westerman. Here's the three. Buries the triple. With him, the scouting report says you've got to go over the screen. Absolutely. He'll hurt you from deep. So you have to fight through those picks. Time called here. The Blazers decide to talk it over. They're trailing by one. Three seconds left to play here in the fourth. Thanking you for watching. See you later.